Hey guys, this is Black Ops Glitches with another quick tutorial on how to create a command prompt and how to have it come up when your computer administrator has disabled it. So every time you go to start, run, you type CMD and you click OK, it should say that it has been disabled by your administrator. Well, that's if you're at a school or something where it's not allowed. But if you're on your own computer, it should just be normal, like mine, like this. But if it does say computer has been has been disabled by your computer administrator, what you want to do is open up a new text document. I got one right here. And you want to type in in all capitals command dot com. This must all be in capitals and it must end in dot com. And now what, how you want to save it as, you want to click save as desktop or any other place you can find it easily desktop is probably the most preferred out of most people. You want to erase the title. This will stay as a text document and the encoding will stay as ANSI. You will only edit the file name. What you want to type is command, all in capitals as well, command dot BAT. If this does not end in BAT, it will not work and this must all be in capital letters. Now once you click save, you have a BAT file saved to your computer which is this. And this is basically kind of like a CFG file which it just starts up a program that you asked it to. So what you want to do is click this and now you have the command prompt open. For an add-on to this, to add colors, type in color Z. This will give you the list of different colors you can name your command prompt. For instance, I can make mine purple and light red. That would be 5C. So what you want to do, type in C-O-L-R and then 5C. Space 5C. Now when you click enter, your command prompt will change colors. This will change the font and the background. Well thank you guys for watching. This has been Black Ops Glitchers with another fast tutorial.